a very warm welcome to the Irish launch of the 19th season of European Club Rugby and the official kick-off of the Heineken Cup and the Amlin Challenge Cup. Pool 1 is uh, Leinster's pool and it includes former champions and recent Heineken Cup finalists Northampton, currently one of the form sides in the English Premiership. Uh, also familiar foes, the Ospreys are there in Pool 1, uh, unbeaten so far on the Rubber Direct Pro 12, so they'll come into the Heineken Cup in good form. And Cast Olympique, of course, current champions of the top 14, doesn't get much tougher than that in Pool 1. Matt, um, I suppose Heineken Cup, very tough pool, you'd have to say. Yeah, definitely. I mean, they're four great sides um, that are in really good form in their domestic leagues. So, you know, we're under no illusions of how tough it is. But, you know, the the uh, disappointment of last year in not getting out of the group has certainly given the boys clarity of, of what's required. Not getting out of the group, but still an established club in the history of the Heineken Cup. Are they tough boots to fill or is it just a case of getting on with it? Oh, yeah, I mean, the expectation is a huge advantage, you know, no one hides behind the expectation. Everybody um, thrives off, off the expectation and, you know, having to be good, having to win things makes everybody's job that little bit easier. Um, and looking into the next couple of weeks then, I mean, starting off this weekend, I suppose, with the, with the local derby, which is, uh, have you, you've heard a fair bit about it, I'd say. I have, yeah, this week in particular. But um, yeah, I mean, the guys are really excited. You know, they they love playing at Tobin Park. It's a, it's a incredibly, it's a ground that's got incredible rugby history, and um, the guys, you know, really looking forward to getting down there and seeing where we are as a, as a group. Uh, Munster in playing particularly well, and you know, it's a perfect curtain raiser for Europe. Have you been to Thomond? Have you been to any matches? Have you, do you know the atmosphere? No, no, I mean, Are you taking a lead from somebody else? No, not really. Um, you know, Leicester went down there a couple of times before I was there. I haven't been there in my time, but uh, they certainly tell uh, very fond stories of, of the atmosphere down there and, and what a special rugby environment it is. And what about the Ospreys then and the, uh, the Heineken? They've they're really they're on form. They're playing very well. Um, you know, great performance last week against Connacht. Uh, they were particularly good against us at the RDS, and um, you know I've had the pleasure to go down there a couple of times with Leicester, and they were very very tough affairs. So you know we'll have to be really good. We'll have to make sure that you know our attitude's right, and and we put out a top quality performance if we're expected to beat them down there. Leo Heineken Cup launched today, and it put the hairs on the back of the neck up. Yeah, listen, some of the memories I would have watched even as a kid. Uh, coming through obviously Toulouse winning the first uh, Heineken Cup so yeah listen great amazing tournament and uh, uh, some great images there If you could pick a team obviously apart from Leinster in the entire competition who would you look out for? Uh, I'd look out for Ospreys the way they're playing at the moment um, listen I think they've, they've started the league very very well um, unbeaten to date and like, they've had three games away from home as well so for me they'd be one of the teams that are I think are very, very dangerous at the moment. And just ahead of them comes the, just the small matter of going to Thomond, really? Yeah, it's uh, three massive weeks for us. Um, I think there's always something a little bit special about going to Thomond. Um, we've had some great battles with uh, with Munster over the last number of years. And um, yeah, there's there, there's special games to be part of uh, for players. Um, it's obviously a stadium that creates an incredible atmosphere down there. And, you know, they're, they've great supporters. and. You know, there's a, for the few uh, Leinster supporters that will brave it down there as well. Um, like it, it creates a great occasion, and listen, it's an occasion that the players love being involved in. And, Give yeah. Matt O'Connor a little bit of a t telling what's what's going to happen or how's it going to be. Yeah, I'm very jealous of the lads that obviously do get to play because listen, they're 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 a great occasion to be part of, and um, I'm sure Matt will find out quick enough uh, what they actually uh, what they mean to uh, everyone involved. <laughs>